The Cotter delusion is a rare mental condition, and very few people understand what it truly means. This will explain what it is, its causes, symptoms, and treatment. Cotter delusion, what it is. This is also called Cotter syndrome or walking corpse syndrome, named after the neurologist Jules Cotter. It is a mental condition involving the patients having a false sense of immortality. Patients suffering from this condition believe themselves to be dead already while still living. They also think their body parts to be missing, feel they're dying, or do not exist in the world. This is an infrequent psychological disorder, as statistics show that only 200 cases of this condition have been reported worldwide. Patients with this condition live on false delusions, and the cause of this could be various underlying psychological, biological, and neurological factors. Hey, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos. Causes of Cotter Delusion or Walking Corpse Syndrome Although it isn't clear yet what the causes of Cotter Syndrome are, certain factors are suspected to be the cause of this condition. More so, certain risk factors expose one to this condition. Causes Multiple Sclerosis Severe case of disease of the brain and spinal cord Subdural bleeding External bleeding in the brain region Frequent cases of migraine Epilepsy Parkinson's disease A condition of nerve cell damage in the brain leading to shaking, stiffness, and inability to coordinate body movement Dementia Memory loss or loss of cognitive functioning Encephalopathy A condition where a virus or toxin affects the brain's functionality Severe depression Among other things Risk factors, who's likely to get it? Research shows that people with certain health conditions are prone to experiencing a walking corpse syndrome. These health conditions are known as the risk factors that expose one to Cotter syndrome. Hence, anyone with these underlying conditions is likely to get it. Based on research, the walking corpse condition cases have been reported mainly in between people in the ages of 25 to 60 and above. However, it can also occur in children and teenagers. Here are some of the risk factors that expose one to this mental condition. Bipolar disorder, injury to the brain, schizophrenia, depression, tumor in the brain, brain infections, stroke, trauma to the brain, etc. Overall, these are some of the risk factors for the walking corpse syndrome. People with this neurological condition behave in a certain way. These behavior traits suggest the signs and symptoms of Cotter syndrome. Signs and Symptoms of the Walking Corpse Syndrome These signs and symptoms have been gathered from a careful study of the behaviors of traits of people with Cotter Syndrome, and they include self-denial, such as a denial of the existence of body parts or essential aspects of life, nihilism, the belief that nothing of value or meaning exists in life generally, depression, anxiety disorder, hypochondria, hallucinations, denial of being alive, self-isolation, Self-denial of things that are an essential part of living beings. People with Cotter syndrome often behave in ways that suggest their immortality. Most times they engage in suicidal behaviors to assure themselves that they are not alive. How can this mental condition be diagnosed and treated? Diagnosis and treatment of the walking corpse syndrome. Diagnosis. Due to the nature of the walking corpse or Cotter syndrome, its symptoms are not like other medical conditions. It's hard to diagnose the illness. Hence, there's no clear-cut method for diagnosing this condition. However, the illness can be identified after ruling out other medical conditions related to the illness symptoms to diagnose it. Treatment How is Cotter syndrome treated? This mental condition can be treated with medications for depression and anxiety disorders, such as antipsychotics, anti-anxiety drugs, and antidepressants. Alongside these medications, therapies such as cognitive behavioral therapy, psychotherapy, or electroconvulsive therapy, ECT, can be used to treat Cotter syndrome. Overall, the walking corpse syndrome is a rare and severe mental condition that causes its sufferers to live in a delusional world of immortality. This could lead to a self-destructive or suicidal behavior pattern, and eventually death if not diagnosed and treated. With proper medications and therapies, Cotter syndrome can be treated. Finally, Please find the links to the references and studies on the Cotter delusion at the description section. I hope that you enjoyed the explanation. Please don't hesitate to share your thoughts and experiences in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon to be notified of subsequent updates. Thanks for watching!